Hey, welcome to the screencast where I get you jump started in Java development. So, we're going to have to install something called JDK, and then we're going to install NetBeans, which uses JDK. JDK is like a low level thing, forget about it, don't think about it. Uh, it's Java Development Kit, lets you develop Java programs. We'll download that, then we'll install NetBeans, which is the actual IDE, and of course, as we all know, IDEs are things that we type our code into, then we push the play button, and then they play our code. So, first Google for JDK, and you'll find that the first hit on, uh, will take you to Java SE Downloads. Go ahead and click Java SE Downloads, and you'll see like a row of four icons. The far left is the Java platform, uh, JDK. And you can scroll down and there's like an accept license and click that and then choose either the 32-bit or the 64-bit download. Go ahead and download that. Pause this video, wait for that to download, or you could start downloading the next thing. The next thing we have to download and install is NetBeans. So Google for NetBeans, and you'll find it actually uh, at the top. Welcome to NetBeans. Um, then you want to download free. Right now, NetBeans IDE 7.0.1 is the pick, and it's an orange button at the moment. Uh, it's like 2011. Uh, and then it takes you to a cool chart. I like this chart, kind of. You can download either just Java SE or Java EE, don't know the difference, or C, C++, and that gives you C++ code, or PHP. For a safe bet, you could go ahead and click the furthest one to the right, all, and it's 245 megabytes. Install that one. Because, uh, yeah, because I don't know what the difference between SE and EE is, and no one should ever have to know the difference. So, uh, download all. Click this download all for the sprint. And as those things are uh, installing, you could you know continue to listen to me rambling, or uh, or pause the video because I'm about to jump start into it now. Double click those things. Hopefully JDK installs just fine. I was having trouble downloading it from the server but whatever. Uh, I used a different browser and it worked. Uh, eventually, once you install JDK and then NetBeans afterwards, there's an order of operations there, double-click NetBeans IDE icon, it should be on your desktop now, and 